Christina here from the Children's Museum of Green Bay and today we are going to make a pipe cleaner firefly. For this project you are going to need two pipe cleaners like this, some wiggly eyes, you'll need three glow-in-the-dark beads and then eight of another color bead and some glue. And that's all, so let's get started. All right, to start, we're going to take one of our pipe cleaners, and I think I'm actually gonna take the green one, and we're gonna fold it in half, like so, and twist one of the ends, the open ends, so that it stays together. So that it's half of the size that it was before. Okay, now I'm going to take the glow-in-the-dark beads, and I'm going to string them on, on the side that I just twisted, put them on that side and push them all the way down. Not all the way off, obviously leave a little bit at the end. See right there. And just like that. And I'm actually just gonna Fold the end a little bit downward so that they don't come off. All right, now I'm gonna take my other beads. I have black beads, I have eight of them, and I'm gonna string eight of them. Uh, I'm sorry, I've got eight of them, but I'm only gonna string six of them on to start. So one, two, three, four, Whoop, <laughs> five, sometimes that happens, doesn't it? Six, okay. Now I'm gonna leave a little space. I'm gonna put the other two on, but I'm gonna leave a space here. Can you see that? Just like that. Not gonna put it right up next to the ones that I just put on. All right. Just like that. And then I'm gonna set this aside and I'm gonna take my other pipe cleaner out. Now I'm gonna create the firefly's wings with these, uh, with this pipe cleaner. So first I'm gonna take one side and bend it towards the middle and make a loop like this and twist it around so that it stays. And then I'll take the other one on the other side, put it towards the middle and loop it around. Now, if you look at it and you think that's not quite equal, my wings aren't, you can always undo it and redo it again. Mine are a, one side's a little bit bigger than the other one, but it'll be okay. All right, now I'm going to go to that empty space that I just left on my uh, other pipe cleaner and I'm put my wings on there like so right in that space and I'm gonna twist it around so that they stay on. So I'm gonna put them on and just kind of wrap them around one time. Just like that. All right, now I've got this big end part here if you would like to, you could cut that off, not all the way, like leave a little bit on the end, but you could cut some of that excess off or you could just bend it backwards like so, so you can't see that. All right, now my firefly needs some eyes. So I'm gonna take my wiggly eyes and I'm gonna go right at the top of my fly here, right up here. I'm going to put two dots of glue. Now I'm just using regular glue for this. If you have hot glue and a parent permission or a parent to help you with that, you could use hot glue as well. But hot glue can be dangerous. So make sure you have a parent helping you with that. All right. And there is my eyeballs. Now you'll have to let this sit for a second so that glue can dry so that it stays on. But there's my firefly. Whoa, can you see it there? Oh, you can see his eyes. Now, what you can do is put this firefly, expose it to the sun for a while so that those glow in the dark beads get some sunlight because then you can bring it into a dark room 
and turn off all the lights and those beads will glow and you will have a glowing firefly. Pretty cool. Well, play well, learn well, and be well. I'm here with my fireflies flying around. We'll see you next time. Bye.